This is a 1996 Harley Davidson Softail Bad Boy doing an oil change. I couldn't find anything to show me how to do it. So I have one of the manuals and I kind of just read through there and found where the tube was. So sorry I already started, but I'll show you where I'm at so far. Here's a little drain tube down here. And it is connected to the frame right right here. And that is right behind the transmission. So that's where your drain hose is. This is your drain hose plug. And it just goes in the hose right here. So I got all my nasty oil drained out. Now I'm going to put the plug back in and remove the filter and replace it and then I'll replace the oil. Sorry about the dishwasher noise. This oil filter wrench really comes in handy and it's just a few dollars. Here's my new filter, ready to go. And that's where it'll go right there in front of the front cylinder. We have a 1996 owner's manual we bought off eBay. My dad found it actually. It says apply a thin film of oil to the gasket contact surface on the mounting plate and to gasket on new oil filter. You can see we put a little bit of oil on the gasket. Also put oil around the contact surface for the filter. It says on all models except the Dynaglide put the filter on until the gasket touches the contact plate surface and then apply another one half to three quarter turn by hand. I put the new filter on there and once the gasket touched the surface I tightened it another one half turn by hand and since I'm a weenie I put the wrench on there and turn it about another one quarter turn. In the manual I downloaded it says uh, 3 US Quartz SAE 20W-50. Also in the owner's manual for the oil tank it says 3 US Quartz. So I figure I'll put in about 2.5 quarts and then check the level. Make sure you have your drain plug back in. Your drain hose before you fill it up with oil. Get a nice clean funnel, ready to put some oil in there, try not to drip any on your paint. Kind of carefully put your oil bottle in there, let it drain out. The stuff ain't cheap. I like to set my funnel in the bottle while I check the level. says the top of the indicator is full in the manual. What you need to do if your bike's like mine, if you try and put three quarts in there, all at once it'll go all the way up to the fill, the neck right here. So what you need to do is put about two and a half quarts in and then you start your bike to let the oil pump circulate that oil throughout the engine and the level will lower inside of your tank right here. 